In a city built on celebrity, it wasn't quite a Hollywood welcome, but football in America is thrilled that Steven Gerrard is here. Under skies more Liverpool than LA, this was Gerrard's first public training session as a Galaxy player alongside his former Anfield teammate Robbie Keane and in front of some curious locals. The media, at least, did turn out for the official welcome. You know, I've, I come here to win. You know, if there's anyone out there who thinks I'm coming here for the holiday and a last paycheck, um, they'll be proved wrong uh, very soon. I'm coming to a wonderful city, you know, away from the training pitch and, and the game. Um, it's a great city for my family to, to live for, for a new life experience. Um, as I say, I've spent all my life in Liverpool. I'm a scouser, I'm proud to be a scouser. But at 35, I felt it was the right time for a new challenge in my life. He says he still misses the club he said goodbye to after 17 years, but decided to bring his family west after talking to the last England captain to play for the Galaxy. And fans in L.A. are delighted. Oh, I mean, it means a lot because it, uh, it's there's there's nothing like the precision. Like when Beckham was here, he'd cross it, cross the field, and drop it. And and so far, there's been very few American players that can do it. So to have Steven Gerrard here, someone who's who's been tried and tested, and just strong in midfield, and can do, and just has the technique and endurance that uh, we, that a lot of our American players are still working on. I mean, it's just it's phenomenal. And life in California has other benefits for a big name sporting import. It's a big city, LA, a big city with a lot of celebrities. And it is a place where I think at times Steven Gerrard will be able to get lost, uh, which he couldn't do in Liverpool. So I think he's going to adjust very well. The key will be how does he adjust on the field. He'll make his debut on Saturday, having already learned one big difference from home. He says here he'll need to play in sunscreen. Greg Milam, Sky News, Los Angeles.